Andrew goes to the gym without a goal in mind. He just lifts, bro. He's the guy that looks like a beginner at the gym that has been going to the gym for six months now. He wonders why he looks like a goddamn skateboard. Ashish. Ashish is a super driven man. He has a goal for every goal for every goal that he has. His current one is to build a super V-shaped cobra body. Luckily for us, he has written down the holy secrets and the holy manuscript of how to build a V-shaped body. The muscles that will get you the pristine V-shaped look on your body are your lats, your pecs, your delts, and your back. Focusing on these muscles and aiming to implement a system in which you are properly training these muscles, you will get that V-shaped look. Now, talking about implementing a system in, in which you, a routine that will allow you to work these muscles out, do just that. Pull out your journal. I don't care what you fucking do. Write it on your head, write it on your hand, write it in your journal. Pull out your stinky ass journal and modify your workout routine. Instead of push pull legs, do push pull legs. Pause! You heard me, right? You want to do push pull legs, or whatever you are already doing, but have an extensive focus on working your lats, your back, your delts, and your pecs. Train those muscles, and you will get that distinct V shaped look. I'm sure there's thousands, there's almost, I think there's almost a million videos out there on fitness videos. So you can do anything, just search online. There's so many good resources out there. I'd recommend checking out C-Bum's fucking video on training pull and push, uh, training those muscles. Now, this is what I usually do. It works for me, at least in my personal experience. And just so you don't fucking die and sue my poor ass, I want you to focus on form. Okay, I don't want you dying under the bench press. Yes, you want to be scared of the bench press, but you don't want to fucking die by asphyxiation because of a, a fucking bench press machine. No, focus on your form, focus on perfecting your technique, and have only after you perfect your technique, progressively overload. Otherwise, you're just going to hurt yourself or you're just going to not see results. Get lean. Okay, so the best way to do this, I'll probably link a video here, 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 here. Here! Okay, over. Oh, I don't care what I'm saying. I'm gonna link a video on screen right now. And for my learning friends that have short ass attention spans, let me tell you just to give you a quick summary if you want to get lean, you gotta shift your identity, you gotta shift your mindset, you gotta shift what's inside. Only after changing the inside will the outside change. I just love this book so goddamn much. Atomic Habits by James Clear. I'd recommend if you are willing to go the extra mile, please read this book. It's on Amazon. It's probably like 20 bucks. Literally, you can get it for 20 bucks. I think you can get it for less secondhand. It's really good. Shift your identity. Implement a system in which, or at least research into what type of people have the results that you want. Research into what they do, their actions, their habits, and then implement a system in which you will you are able to implement these habits and actions that will get you closer to that identity shift okay so just to illustrate okay i, I think i need to go more in depth in here i'm saying look at fucking lebron jahamis he is the most beautiful fucking man i've seen on the planet in terms of physique aesthetics just look at him fucking six nine right favorite number by the way and fucking He's got, I don't know, he just, he just he just has the perfect body in my opinion. Now, what I would do in order to get lean, hey, I'm looking at fucking LeBron James. I'm looking at his physique. I'm just, I'm just aw shook. I'm telling myself, I am going to become LeBron James, literally. And I will believe it. I'll take out my, my stinky ass journal and I'll fucking write in this shit. I'll write down, I am going to become LeBron James. And I research into what the, what the what the fuck he does, right? All the the habits that he does, all the workout routines. I'll do this that shit, and then I'll do this consistently for like two months, and I will literally become Asian LeBron James, and consequently that will get me lean. And for my learning friends, in order like you might argue that you don't have to get lean, but 
I'm saying you gotta get lean to a certain point in order for your muscles to show. You can't have muscles show unless there's a right amount of fat, right? You wanna cut down a bit. You want you don't want your muscles being covered by a fucking layer of skin and fat. You don't want that happening. Elsewise, your muscles are just not gonna show. I digress. Okay, so no, actually, we're not moving on. Get lean and focus on diet. You want to, one, shift your identity. And two, you want to focus on your diet too. If your diet is not right, you aren't going to lose weight. You aren't going to shed weight. You aren't going to be able to, even if you want to bulk up, you aren't going to be able to bulk up because you can't control yourself. One, you've got to be disciplined to the point where you're able to control yourself, control what you eat. You're mindful, you're conscious of the decisions you make throughout your day. And two, you got to know what is best for your body. So single ingredient foods. I highly recommend you check out that video over there. I'll link it on screen right now because I think it's, it's got a lot of good tips and it goes really in depth. If you're really interested, if you really are serious about this, read the book or watch that video, apply the things and read the book, Atomic Habits. I digress. Moving on. Train lower abs. I know I said earlier that you want to train, you know, the, this, this, these, this range of muscles, your pecs, your delts, your back, and your lats, right? That will give you that distinct V-shaped look. But also, something that I think is mad underrated as fuck. I just turned British right there. What I'm saying is... I'm saying you want to train your lower abs so that you have that distinct fucking V-shaped, lower V-shaped look. That's the lower part of the V. It's not a fucking V, it's just two fucking lines if you don't have a lower part of the V, if you know what I'm saying. The two lines have to meet, elsewise you're just gonna have fucking two lines that are floating there. What the fuck? Yo, I, th I think I'm high right now, but like, I digress. A lot of good resources out there, search up what Chris Bumstead does, search up what Jeff Nippard does, and they've got plenty of good videos out there, so I recommend checking them out. Get the basics down. Yeah. So you heard me right. Back to LeBron James. I just fucking love LeBron James. LeBron James. Why is he so good at swimming? It's because he has the basics down. He eats, he sleeps, he shits, and he trains like a god fucking champion. Most people nowadays, they don't even fucking sleep. Okay, we're, we're all pent up uh, because we're horny as fuck and uh, because of, of fucking, I don't know, uh, capitalism. We're up until like 3 a.m. in the morning. What do we do? What are we doing at 3 a.m.? Ah, no. It's fucking stupid. You want to master the basics. You want to sleep. You want to sleep like a fucking baby and a champion. Like LeBron James. You want to eat properly. You want to train properly. And most importantly, you want to make sure that your digestive system works. I digress. Master the basics. And you'll see that V-shape. Look, this leads me to my final point. Just fucking do it. I can't stress this enough in every single video I make. Repetition is the mother of success. A wise man once said, just do it. How else are you going to do it? Oh no, I'm going to do it tomorrow. What happens? You fucking, you say you're going to do it tomorrow and then tomorrow is the same story. Oh no, I'm going to do it tomorrow. Just do it. What's keeping you back? Just do it. If you want to see the rainbow, you got to put up with the rain. Peace. My name is Andy Lean, and I create a lot of videos centered on self-improvement and helping you reach your greatest aesthetic potential. If you like an occasional laugh, a joke, and of course some fitness and self-improvement, consider leaving a like, commenting, and subscribing. Remember, if you want to see the rainbow, you got to put up with the rain. Peace. Ah.